I'm Gabrielle Pantera. I am here with Elise Levesque, who plays Mary Ellen on Cedar Cove. How are you today? I'm good. How are you doing? I am doing great. So when you auditioned for Cedar Cove... Mm -hmm. Interesting. I actually, I actually didn't audition. You didn't. Story. I didn't. Okay, so tell yeah. me. Okay, no, I've got to hear this story now. Like, yes, I've got to hear like, this story. No, no, that's <laughs> fine. Um, what happened was I had a, a relationship with um, one of the producers, Carl Carl Bender. Okay. He produced Stargate Universe, which was a show right. that I he he was a writer and producer on Stargate Universe. Right. And he contacted me and was like, "I've got this character in this show, mm -hmm. and I think." You'd be great for it. You're who I thought of when I started writing it. He was also a writer. Ah, okay, that helps. And um, and yeah, so he, you know, brought it to my attention, and that's sort of how that happened. That's how that happened. Yeah. I, that is the best way. Yeah, I, it really is because you've got an in. It is. You know, it's it's a funny thing happens with being offered a part. I feel in a way like. I suppose, I guess I have earned it, but it's different from, you know, as much as the audition process sort of eludes me, I find it all very uh, um, archaic. Mm -hmm. um, it at least gives you a sense of, okay, I've earned this, I've proven myself that, that I am the person mm -hmm. for this part. Um, so I definitely felt a different kind of pressure coming onto it and that this person's put this faith in me. They think that I can do this and I, I'm not sure if I can, but let's find out. <laughs> well, but he also saw you work in Star... Yes, but it was a completely different character. Yeah, Very but I think, I think he could tell. Obviously, yes. <laughs> he could, obviously, he could tell. He had faith in me, which, yeah. which I was very grateful for. So they shoot where? Um, mostly around Vancouver, around the greater Vancouver area. Okay, that makes and, sense. Um, a place called Fort Langley is where actually most of our sets are, which okay. is this old, um, it was an old trading fort. Okay. I actually don't know when it was established, but it's quite old. I've shot there for a few other things. It's, it's really so it was going a cute home. little town. As in, a, in a way, I suppose, yeah, I suppose, yeah, we did, oddly enough, do some Stargate stuff out there, and, um, but in very different, they shot it in the more, like, modern, um, part of the, part of the town, modern, sort of, like, quaint mm -hmm. part of the town, and then, um, a bunch of stuff was shot in Deep Cove, which mm -hmm. is one of my favorite parts of Vancouver, they have the best donuts. It do you want to give a shout out to your hometown? The, well, yeah. It's a city that rhymes with fun, so I feel like I should say it out loud. I'm from Regina, <laughs> Saskatchewan, <laughs> Canada. <laughs> I love, I love it. saying it because Canadians are so used to hearing it. Growing mm -hmm. up, I didn't think anything of it. I mean, I knew, I knew what it sounded like, but it was never like I never felt the need to pause before I said it. But right. Since, it's like since I've been living in the states, I. Um, Anytime I'm I'm introducing myself and someone's like, "Where are you from?" and I say it, and I actually get great pleasure watching the reaction, reaction. <laughs> the because reaction. they're like, so "There's this moment of like kind of like stunned silence." And like, I'm, like, oh, I'm sorry, what? <laughs> <laughs> where, where, where are you from? And I tell them it's just south of Clitoris. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> That's good. Are you sure you don't want to be a comedian? I actually, I don't know about that. Ah. I, I think you could do a stand-up uh, routine. I don't know all about Regina and. I think I think you could do a stand-up routine. I really do. Yeah. Okay. Well, maybe that's something I'll work on. Yeah. Next time. I, I think so. Definitely. Mm -hmm. So, um, studying though. Right. Uh, when I, I I didn't start uh, really studying until I moved to Vancouver. Okay. And uh, I never went to drama school. I went to university briefly for uh, art history, and okay. visual arts, but. Mm -hmm. um, I, uh, when I moved to Vancouver, I found out about a teacher named Michelle Lonsdale-Smith who taught at what used to be the Lyric School of Acting and okay. is now Lonsdale-Smith Studios here in Los Angeles. Oh, wow, okay. And uh, New York and Toronto and Vancouver. She kind of teaches all over. Um, so I started studying with her twice a week and I've been on and off for the last seven years. Oh, wow. It's one of those things you can come to it and then if you get work or something mm -hmm. comes up, you can go away and come back to it. 